Hey guys, welcome back to my channel MI Tutorial. In this particular video, I'm going to teach you how to merge multiple files into one single Excel file. So let's say you have, I have a sample data set here where I have three different columns here. I have name, I have quantity, I have amount. Now this is a uh, part of my serials uh, workbook, right? And then I have another workbook called as fruits, which also has the same sort of information. It has the same column names and it has different uh, data set of course right so how do you combine all of these uh, workbooks into one single uh, workbook right let's say if you have hundreds of workbooks with you and you want to combine all of the data into one single workbook so what is the easiest way to do this so let's take a look at this uh, you need to go to the data tab click on get data click on from file and click on from folder so when you click on from folder, it will take you to this particular screen where it is asking you to select the folder path. I'm going to click on browse and I'm going to scroll down and go to the folder where I have all the files uh, saved. And then I'm going to click on OK. So when I click on OK, what happens is it basically tells me that these are all the files uh, which are there in that particular folder. Now it is telling me that cereals and fruits file are open. So I'm just going to go and close them. Oops, sorry, let me just go back. Close cereals and uh, fruits workbook. Come back here, get data, file from folder. Now, let me quickly go and select the merge folder. Click on OK. So now what happens is it only says that there are three files in that particular folder and it also gives you some more information as to what type of file it is, when was it last accessed, modified, created, etc, etc. And then I'm going to click on combine and load. Right. When I say combine and load, it will directly get me data into this particular uh, uh, sheet over here. I'm going to just click on combine and load. Let's see what happens. It'll it's going to take some time and it, this is the sheet one the sample file is what it is showing me here. And I'm going to click on OK. The moment when I click OK, what happens is the basically Excel tries to merge all of those files into uh, one single file. So as you can see here, there's a new column that is created, which is basically telling that it's part of the cereals or the fruits or the vegetables file. And then it gives me the data name, quantity, amount, which was there part of these files. So if you see here, cereals were part of this. These, this is the data that was part of the cereals workbook. And this was the data which was part of the fruits workbook and this is the data that was part of the vegetables workbook. Now this is the easiest and simplest way to combine all of your workbooks into one single work workbook provided that you have all the column names uh, in the similar fashion. Right? I hope this video has helped you. Please do hit a like and give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more such videos.